Say I was born 10 years ago. Uh, it is an, uh, an institute uh, whose aim is to connect companies, Portuguese companies and uh, universities. Uh, we've been developing several projects mainly in the automotive industry and since 2009 we started uh, the aerospace department um, and the idea is to enhance the Portuguese uh, competitiveness. If you want to work in automotive and aerospace nowadays you have to be able to, to simulate as you know, uh, tests and, uh, and doing prototypes is expensive. So you have to be able to, to simulate the solutions your engineers or our engineers uh, are developing. So if you're not able to, to do that, you have to spend more time to, to spend more money. And therefore, we have to find solutions uh, which allow us to, uh, to, well, to simulate and analyze the results and to, and to check the um, the validity of the solutions we've found for our customers. We know that the, the, um, the solutions ANSYS provide us with are reliable solutions. Uh, they are compatible with uh, other softwares, so we are able to do lots of things to connect and interact with other tools. And we know that um, we still have a lot of improve, uh, improvement to, to do, but uh, so far we have been using ANSYS very successfully, and the customers are happy. We're basically doing CFD calculations with ANSYS. We've got the Fluent, the T-Grid, and the Gambit modules. Uh, we've been doing aerodynamic, basically aerodynamic uh, calculations and optimization. Um, we got data from wind tunnel, and uh, we have to validate this data. We have to optimize this data. And ANSYS seems to be a very reliable uh, way of doing it. Uh, besides that, we have um, to interact with uh, other uh, computer-based um, models. And we have to find tools which are compatible with this. And, and ANSYS is, is capable of, of doing this. We know that using ANSYS will save us and has saved us money and time uh, because we can deliver uh, what the customer is asking for on time and, uh, and being sure that the results are, are reliable. So uh, if you don't have ANSYS, probably We'd have to spend much more time in the office. We'd have to run much, much more, many more simulations, and we'd have to have, of course, many more people working and checking the data before we deliver it to the, to the customer. It would be difficult for us not to work with 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 answers if we want to achieve, I mean, the the, the level of excellence and 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 the level of um, of you know of being capable of facing challenges with the main OEMs. We have to to use answers.